EJ4 is kind of uh, used to define stages of kidney disease, and there are five stages of kidney disease based on how high the GFR is. Um, the more advanced or the more serious stages are stages four and five, for example, and stages one and two, those are actually good. And so one of the things we do as physicians um, are kind of looking at the individual's EGFR. Um, and as um, and Jamila mentioned, you know, it, it suggests when the kidney is doing its job of cleaning the body of waste products, the EGFR level should be good. And then also if we see protein or um, blood in the urine, that also suggests that there could be a disease process that's going on that's affecting the kidney. And similarly, if somebody has been diagnosed with IgA nephropathy uh, over their lifetime, they can have different you know, fluctuations in both the blood level of the EGFR or the amount of protein um, or blood in the urine. And those are some of the tests that we can do to kind of monitor how the kidneys are working or the severity or the degree of the IgA nephropathy at any given time. Mm -hmm.